Hey guys, what's up? This is Nanya from TechBarrack Solutions and today I will be reviewing the Mac OS X El Capitan operating system which was launched yesterday for the general public. It's a 6 gigabyte download that you may have to do and once you're done, you will get a bunch of cool features and some tweaks that makes your Mac fast. Well, is it really fast or not? Let's find out and how good are the features? So coming to the number one feature, that's split view. It allows you to split the screen into two applications so you can multitask. It's a very famous feature on Windows operating system and now that Apple Mac OS X has it, it adds on to the list of awesome features that Mac OS X already has. Notes have been updated too. You can add in rich content to notes and this rich content includes checklist, photographs, and even locations from maps, which is pretty cool. Maps can also be used to send directions directly to your iOS device. This feature is already there on Google Maps. And again, now that it is there in Apple Maps too, it is just a great feature to have. In case you forget where your cursor is, you can just move in your mouse and the cursor will enlarge itself. You can now sort the photos inside the albums too and you can edit the photographs with additional filters which is pretty cool. Coming to Safari, if you are a Safari user, you're gonna love this. If you have some tabs with music or multimedia content being played, then you can mute that content right from the address bar itself which is a very good feature to have because sometimes you never know where exactly the sound is coming from. The spotlight can be used to search more efficiently. It uh, now supports better natural language processing. So you can search something like documents that you opened today, documents that you opened last week, something like that, and it will give you the results. It's pretty cool. Apple has brought the Metal Core Graphics technology to the Mac OS X operating system too. Developers can make use of this technology to combine the CPU performance and the GPU performance to develop better efficient applications which are faster and more responsive. The new mail application creates suggested events based on the textual information in the mail and this allows you to create the event in the calendar by just a click of a button. This is a very good utility for users who have their entire itinerary set on the calendar application. Coming to the final section that is the speed section. Apple claims that the new operating system opens applications 40 times faster, it is 2 times faster at application switching, it is 2 times faster at loading the mails and the messages, and it is 4 times faster in loading PDF files in the preview application of the Mac OS X operating system. Can you observe the speed difference? If you have lots of data on the computer, then yes, you can easily observe this difference especially on applications such as iTunes or Photos which has got lots of data, lots of photographs, lots of music and when it's loading these applications, it loads faster than the previous operating systems. Otherwise, you won't observe much of a difference and coming to the conclusion section, I would say this is an operating system with tweaks and nothing as a big overhaul as such which we generally expect with each Mac OS X operating system, but I would definitely recommend you to update yourself to the latest operating system because these are tweaks which you want in your day to day work and it really improves your productivity. And apart from that, with new updates, you get better security. So go ahead and update your operating system. That's it with this video, guys. I hope you liked it. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and visit techparic.com.